Hi guys, what's up? Welcome to a new video of French Casual. So today we're going to talk about a very common French expression, which is se la pété. So what does it mean? How often is it used? We're going to say it now. So first, to talk about the signification of the verb pété. Pété in French actually means to fart. Yes, not very romantic, let's say. So if you say, for example, I keep farting in class, you would say in French, je n'arrête pas de péter en classe. That is just the way it is. It is pété. There is also a slang, which is se pété. So it's a bit different. Farting is simply pété. Je pète. I fart. And the other one is se pété. So that, this one is a slang and it basically means to break something. So I broke my leg. Uh, it is je me suis pété la jambe. Or I broke my ankle. Je me suis pété la cheville. But the third one is se la pété. Se la pété. Se la pété basically means to brag about something or basically to show off. And that is something that is used very often in France. So, for example, if somebody says, Je me la pète, it basically means, uh, or il se la pète, it basically means it, he keeps bragging about it, for example. So, se la pète, where does such an expression come from? That is actually very weird, right? Uh, so, it actually comes from Quebec. And uh, back in the 19th century in Quebec, uh, men used to snap their suspenders against their chests and that would obviously make a noise which was basically called um, sa pète. Basically sa pète, that would mean it makes a noise. So they were basically making their suspenders snap against their chest. And uh, this is something they used to do when they were proud or when they were bragging about something. So this is where the expression se la pété theoretically comes from. So just a few examples to show you how to use it. So basically you could say, oh, these guys, uh, this guy keeps showing off. Um, this guy at school keeps showing off and uh, it's very annoying or it's very irritating. So you would say, ce mec, il n'arrête pas de se la Pété. So he doesn't stop showing off and uh, he doesn't stop showing off for nothing and that's super irritating. Or you could say my friend started a company that became very successful and he doesn't stop bragging about it. So that would be my uh, mon ami a démarré une entreprise qui connaît un gros succès et il n'arrête pas de se la péter avec ça. Il n'arrête pas de se la péter avec ça. He doesn't stop bragging about it. Or another example would be um, Mon ami a eu la meilleure note en mathématiques et il n'arrête pas de se la péter depuis. So my best friend or my friend got uh, the best grade in math and he doesn't stop bragging about it. 